Do you think the hedge fund industry is in a permanent decline? No, I don't, because I think there's a tremendous amount of capital out there. I think it's tougher for the smaller guys. I think uh, the business has become uh, substanti much more inst institutionalized. I think the fee structure may have to change a bit, but there's always going to be the need for uh, high-quality investors. There's no question about it. When you say fee structure might have to change a bit, what do you mean? Well, you know, do you pay 2 and 20 for a f for a, for a fund that uh, matches what's happening in the S and P, I don't think. Uh, Should any think, fund right now be paying, be, be charging two and? Well, 20? there's always guys that will outshine uh, the rest of the group. Um, you know, there has to be some flexibility, I think, going forward in that in that fee structure, but. Um, it's very tough for investors to look at it and say, "I'm going to pay two and 20, mm -hmm. but yet you're 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 barely beating the S and P. Is that worth two and 20?" Um, I don't think so. But uh, you have to think that there are people out there, uh, there are funds out there, and, and quality, talented people who can who deserve the the two and 20. Right. Um, well, you know, speaking about the hedge fund world, um, you know, we just got the news this morning about Steve Cohen and how he's, you know, in anticipation of the SEC ban being lifted, he's now raising uh, external, you know, raising outside money, about $10 billion or so. Uh, is $10 billion in this day and age, I mean, you just mentioned there's so much cash out there, right? Is that too much? Listen, I think, I don't, I don't know um, from Steve's, I mean, you know of Steve's uh, abilities and capabilities, I think right. there's no question that he can manage that money, and it is a, a substantial amount, but uh, I think his structure probably uh, works for uh, that type of capital, but I don't know exactly, you know, all the details behind it. Would you ever want to go back? I mean, I know I asked this before, but would yeah. you, would you, if you were in that position, want to want to be managing that much money? No, I'm I'm very happy doing what I'm doing, and ultimately, I look at it as our market cap will hopefully get at or close to and even <laughs> right. surpass that. That's my ultimate goal.